Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Spyro 2 Ripto's Rage. Uh, oh, I'm gonna eat my words now. I was about ready to say it looks like I fixed the frame rate issues, but then it lagged right then and there. So I'm just gonna eat my words before I even say it. Now when we left off, we completed Skelos Badlands, Zephyr, and we backtracked back into, uh, Summer Forest, completed that, and we also completed Sunny Beach. So we're heading into Breeze Harbor. Now, before I head in here, I'm going to make a bit of a statement here. Um, I have seen the Spyro Reignited Trilogy. They have released some preview uh, images of Breeze Harbor, and I am excited, to say the least, for it. But odds of me being able to afford it are pretty slim. But I'm, it's not that I'm upset about it or anything. I'm not asking anyone to buy it for me. But um, I am looking forward to the game. Oh, hello. Wow. Please excuse excuse our mess, Spy Spyro. We are currently currently suffering from a from a land blubber blubber infestation station. First they put out they put out the fires on our on our boilers, and and now they've shut down shut down our ship too. too. All right, let me minimize uh, the bandy window. If you could, if you could stoke up the fires, fires under the boilers, I'm sure, I'm sure you could make your way to the ship. The steam from the boilers will activate our highly advanced machines. Oh. <laughs> Didn't they say something about the breeze builders attacking Zephyr? Ah! -ha! Like, didn't the people of Zephyr say something about the Breeze Builders attacking them? So these guys are under attack? It's, it's, oh. This is weird. I really feel like I don't belong in this scenario. I had a box. Or, uh, I had just hit another one. I just saw one over there. I saw him. <sighs> My leg is itchy. He's like right. Got him. Son of a. F This music sounds a lot like the music from, uh, um, crap, what was it called? Um, Beast Swamp? I really can't remember what it was called, but it, it sounds like that world, that home world in, uh, Spiral 1. Can I go over there? Something tells me I shouldn't. Yeah, I shouldn't. You ain't hit me this time, land blubber. Those lands, land blubbers of litter, de litter these metal spike mines, all mines all over the harbor. If you, if you can clear them out, out, I'll, I'll give you this orb I orb I found in a clam yes am yesterday. <laughs> Shoot down the floating mines. It says it's a four star, but really, I don't think it's a four star level. 
if anything, it's more time consuming than anything. More than difficult. Yeah, see, it was just... I should do it. Alright, so that's gone on the other side. Whoops. Alright, here's another one. Da 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 So I've been playing uh, Outlast the past uh, couple of days. There we go. Thanks, Spyro. Oh, here's that or by or by promise. Sorry if it's sorry if it still has clam juice. It sounds like Hunter's voice. Uh, I've been playing Outlast for the past couple of days. Um, I wanted a different change of pace. I haven't been recording it because the last time I tried um, recording Outlast, the frame rate was so bad to where I couldn't even exit the groom's den. So to avoid any uh, complications, I just did an off playthrough of it. And I played it on the uh, difficulty before the insane difficulty, and it was ridiculously hard. Like, I can't even count how many times I died to the frame rate having, um, ow. The frame rate having stuck me against a wall and I couldn't even open a door. That's not me making an excuse of, like, poor gameplay or anything. I will openly admit when I am bad at a game. But... That's just poor... That's just poor, uh... Lag quality when, uh... No matter how hard you try, it doesn't even ac accommodate for, uh... The possibility of lag. And when you do lag, it doesn't even... Uh, compensate for it. I need 14. Okay. Should be 14 up there. Have it That's number 14 right there. I hear him. Just catch up to him. Because I know if I try going the other way around, he'll turn around. Got him. Now, I'm not going to raise the boat just yet. I'm going to go ahead and complete this challenge over here. Um, I've already read the news on Steam about the next... Oop. How lucky for me that you came along. My machinery is broken, and the gears I need to repair it are scattered all over the tracks. Would you hop on that trolley up there and get them? I guess I should, but, you know. Why the- why- why- why are your gears on the tracks? Wouldn't a trolley, you know, get stuck on the gears? Whatever. I mean, this is too bad. It could be worse. No.
Those lag spikes are not helping my anxiety! shove it in your beak. You have room there. Big beak. But, um, as I was saying, I've heard, a uh, word that the next Outlast is going to be, uh, Yes, it's going to be that. Sorry. I, I don't want to lose, uh, any lives yet. I'm, I'm doing great so far. Um, in my previous uh, playthrough, I went so far as I think part four or five without dying. And I'm gonna try to make a playthrough without dying and <gasps> so far I'm doing pretty well. I can't guarantee a playthrough with no damage, but I can definitely guarantee a playthrough with no deaths, you know. Or at least try to. Ow, my head. I mean, as I was explaining, um... Outlast is scary on its own without it being in VR. So if it were in VR, good god, it's going to be one massive terror show. I know I should be talking about like Spyro and such instead of Outlast, but you know, there's not much to really talk about with Spyro. We know what this is. There's not much for me to really genuinely discuss when it comes to this game. Um, I'm not playing the Reignited trilogy. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. And I'm just, you know, discussing my thoughts here. There's me. See my butt. Hanging in the breeze. Thanks for getting our ship fired up, Spyro. Now we can proceed with our counterattack on Zephyr. Please take this talisman as a token of our gratitude. I knew it! Well, that happened. Now there will be a world that I won't be able to 100% uh, here. <laughs> no hit him. No, 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 do him. No, him, him. Uh, I need the head bash ability, and I don't have that. I don't get it until I go into Winter Tundra. And Winter Tundra is quite a ways away. Because, yep. um... I think it's, uh, it's not this world. This is what, Scorch? Yeah, Scorch. Um, there are two worlds here I won't be able to 100%, I think. Because I need the um, the head bash ability. Uh, there is a portal over here. Uh, let's go ahead and take care of it. Crystal Glacier. I always end up forgetting Crystal Glacier when I come through here. I don't know why.
I love how he like accepted his fate. Viral, the elf, the ice wizards have imprisoned our leader, Shaman Tuck. Can you can you help us rescue him? Cue him. It is urgent, urgent. He has our ticket, our tickets to tonight's hockey game in Colossus Valley. Widgie. You get on the catapult, we'll help you across the chasm. Kludgy. I'd love to get on the catapult, but, um... Get in with your snowball, see what happens. You bullet chase. Looks like my fire breath is really useful here. Okay, he's not gonna talk. He will. What's your name? Watch. We'll help you climb this wall up ahead. Iggy. So we've had Widgy, Kludgy, and Iggy. I barely even really need those guys. I almost did not see him there, to be honest. I, I knew there was something there, but I didn't know what it was. Of course, there's money bags. Whoa. What kind of field is this? Is this supposed to be snow and what acid? Yeah, just feel my uh, feel, fear my uh, side horn because you didn't even get the full. Oh, blah, blah. You didn't even feel the full brunt of it, dude. Okay, so clearly. Can't do much from there. Hey, how you doing, money bags? Hello there, Spyro. I could arrange. I could arrange for you to cross this bridge for <coughs> a small fee. Small fee. What? Hundred gems? Two hundred gems? Yeah, two hundred gems. Thank you, Spyro. Now I can buy. I can buy that condo in Hurricanes that I've been wanting for wanting for so long. Go ahead across the bridge. Mm, thank you. I didn't eat ya. You greedy bum. Be be careful on the other side of that bridge. I don't I don't want anything bad to happen to my to my favorite customer. Oh, you actually do care, huh? Spare me your platitudes, you butt. Snow wizards, I think. I think that's what they are. Hard to tell, really. Oh, this mission. I remember this mission. I always thought it was in Spyro 3 for some reason. 
I lost my pet snow leopard. I was busy fishing, and when I turned around, he was gone. I hope George didn't get eaten by the draglets. Bring back the snow leopard. I can do that. There he is. Hey there, cutie. That makes sense. Lead me to the next fishy, my good sir. I can only imagine how adorable this mission will look in the uh, remastered. Go get that. Go get the fishy. Your tummy's gonna be full of fishies. You know what's good about a dragon helping you get some fishies? It comes pre-roasted! What's up, buddy? Oh, that was cute. Come on. I'll take you back to your buddy. Yeah, you're still behind me. Good. George. I'm so glad he's safe. I'll be sure to pay more attention to him from now on. All I have with me is this round shiny thing I caught while I was fishing. You can have it if you like. Were you using it as a fishing lure? Probably. Fish like shiny things sometimes. He's so cute. Ugh. What's not cute is walking into a wall though. Okay, Augie. So all of them end with E at the end of their name. Good god, freaking guys have hops. Oh jeez. Oh! Uh, ow. You, you think those guys could have got me out of me out of here without rolling a two ton, two -ton snowball onto my head? Here, here, take this crystal. I traded some hockey, ti hockey tickets for it. It's pretty. Alright, now all that's left is, um... Oh, that's nice. All that's left is, uh... Oh! That's even nicer. Hey, how you doing? We used to give guided tours of these caves, these caves, but now they are infested with multiplying dracolins. Dracolins. It's only a matter of time before they take over our whole, our whole village. Do you think you can get rid of them? Get rid of them for us? Sure. Great. But remember, you have to catch them all quickly, quickly, because if any are left alive, they will continue to multiply. I. Okay, you flame all the draclets and use the superfly power up. Yeah, you have to hit them all sequentially or they will multiply again. Look at that little.
Gonna be quick enough. Gotcha. You have saved us all from a grisly fate. Please accept this orb as a small token of our thanks. You owe me. Well, I know I just said you owe me, but I didn't mean the orb, you know? Just whatever. I'm gonna go pick up these gems. Should be what 35 more gems? There's a 10 somewhere. Nope, there they are. <laughs> oh, that was cute. This job is just like, nah, really, man? Really? Okay, so the next level that I'm gonna do. And the last level I'm going to be doing for this episode will be Scorch. Get on the ladder. I think I remember this one. It's kind of like a an Arabian desert sort of feel um, with two kids, Hansel and Gretel. Or Hansel and, Hansel and Greta, I think is what they are called. Close. Handel and Gre Greta. I almost called her Greta. Her her way of speaking is so. It's it, it, it gets stuck in your head sometimes. Is that a two-legged camel? He's got a gun. Well then. You have to admit though, for the time that Spyro came out, this is pretty well made. Yeah, that is a two-legged camel. Oh, 
Uh, so apparently the spoke that camel was tied to was apparently part of his soul. Looks like it's a camel ostrich with the way it was digging his head into the ground. Costrich? Oh, that sounds wrong. Fuaminamana! No. Oh, this mission. Monkeys in a barrel, you know. The monkeys have escaped from the Avalar Zoo, and I've been sent here to catch them. But they keep throwing coconuts at me, and it hurts. Can you help me out? I guess. Great. I just charge the tree before I get hit. I get hit. I'll be able to catch the monkeys as they fall. Follow me. Sure. No, my head. Uh. You're next. Spyro, please take this. One of the one of the monkeys had it. Well, is he gonna throw it at you? Cause uh, you know, I really think that mission should make it to where the monkeys can't hurt you. Cause that. <sighs> Were those monkey monkeys or apes? They looked more like apes. They didn't have tails really, but they were definitely monkeys. I'm not saying that all monkeys have tails, but they were definitely monkeys. Apes are uh, sufficiently larger than monkeys are. Okay, Captain World Diver. Just gonna disobey the laws of physics and dive through the freaking time space continuum to try to kill me. It's real nice of you. I appreciate it. Look at that guy patrolling the gate like he's tough. You ain't so tough. Wait till I come over there and flame your tush. Thanks. I appreciate the help, bro. Less work I have to do, the better, you know? Okay, I was pressing the X button. Ay ha hi 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 It seems like there is a power-up in every single level. I don't know what this power-up is, but I know there is one. Hmm. Don't shoot my butt. You can't skin me, I'm not a gator. Don't skin me. Cock that rifle one more time, see what happens. Oh wait, you're dead. Eh. 
And I'm still alive. Oh wait, there's a mission here that involves a, a genie. Bongo or something? Bongai? Bongi? I can't remember his name. His name starts with a B, I know that much. Um, he steals the flags that are on top of the pedestals. Or, or the flagpoles up there. And we have to chase him down and get them back. I remember when I was younger, it was such an infuriating mission because you had to dodge bombs that he would throw at you and it was so hard. I just jumped over his head. I think it was nobody's business. Yeah, I was right, there is a power up. Well, there's handle. Let's go talk to Greta, though. How you doing, Greta? Scarab. to a scarab beetle. Gross. Have you seen my brother's handle? He's stupid and wearing an ugly shirt. <laughs> wow. Ouch. Yo, handle, did you hear what your sister said to you? Or said about you? Oh. Get all these goody goodies. Oh dear. Yay, yay, yay. Leave it to me to get hit in a dumb way. Then again, that happened in Outlast, too. Um, not Outlast 2, as in the Miracle 2, but I mean also. Safipa. What's up? Hey, hey, Spyro, we need those flags to prove our, sec prove our secret mission was successful. But the flag keeper keeps keeper keep stealing them. If you could knock the flag keeper down, you could bring the flags back. My secret decoder ring says that this power power up thing should help you. Shoot flag keeper off flagpole. Return to handle with the flags. This is a difficulty of five. Here I go. There's the exit. But I'm not gonna shoot him there. I'm actually gonna boink. I want these gems. Oh, I missed one. Bing, 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 bing. bing, bing. Excuse me. Yeah, I cannot remember. Uh, this guy's name. Okay, that's all the gems. Now I just need to get the orbs. And the last orb should be this guy, the flag keeper. I need to knock down all three flags that were on top of the poles. And I need to chase down the flag keeper and bring it back here. But he will throw bombs in my direction, and I cannot stop charging. Or at least, if I want to be successful, I really can't. There I have it. I get him. Hey, how you doing? What's your name? So, Bombo. You want that flag, eh? Flag, eh? Dragon? Well, 
Bombo. He looks like a diaper baby. Bring it on! All right then, right then. Let's go. Bring it on, Bombo. Yes, I know. Now that one was easy. Okay, so I can stop charging. Problem is, is that he starts throwing more bombs when you stop charging. I'm gonna get those bombs. Or not bombs, these flags from you, Bombo. Bombo. It, will he be in the next game? I don't know. It seems kind of risky. Boop! Get him. How you doing? Still after my flash, dragon? Yes. It doesn't really seem like he's throwing bombs at me, it seems more like he's throwing just magical particles. You just threw that in your own face. How do you feel about that? that hard. Can't believe I failed the easiest one first, though. Ow. Drive my face into the dirt. Still after my flags, dragon? Yes. Yes, I am. I'm gonna get that flag. Diaper baby. You won't get my last, my last flag so easily, purple beast beast. Excuse you. Want to bet? I, I lost the first challenge and that wow. Great job, Agent Spyro, Spyro. How can we repay you, pay you for your efforts? How about this orb this orb that I found in the sand? Were you just digging in the sand and you found it? I mean, I'm not gonna judge, but I'm gonna judge. Thanks. Oh, I, I thought the uh Talisman was cut off, but no, I forgot it was just it's just a scarab, so Twins. 
They can decimate all. Good God. Glad I'm on their side. Well, this has been Let's Play Spyro Ripto's Rage. I have been Enraged Aaron, and I will see you all next time. Good God, I am not messing with those twins.